Okay, so I'll be using two release agents. I have good results with it. So this is just a, a wax, and this is a spray. Just as a, as a last resort, I'll just add some of these, just to make sure that the parts is easily to demold after all. So this is the cover. I'm the plug I'm going to work on with some carbon fiber and I'll be waxing it in now I'll do it like three or four times with this and just two coats of this so. okay so um, this is the carbon fiber I'm going to use so this is 600 grams square meter of um, keeper um, weave so I'm going to use this just remove some strands until I get enough of them. So. So you can see there are many bubbles inside, so I'm going to use the gassing chamber, vacuum chamber and just the gas stuff. So put it in. So um, my memory cord was full, so I wasn't able to record how I taped it, but it's quite basic. Uh, just taped it around, just to make it um, very strong and put everything strongly together. So I'm going to open this now and see what the results are, so I'm quite curious about this one. Here we have it, I was expecting something else, so um, this is still quite a good result, I'm quite happy about it. Um, I was expecting to see some lines, but I see that all the carbon fiber was just flattened out, so um, I'm left with carbon fiber, very light piece I think. So I'll have to do some trimming and get the part out of this, and um, I should have an iPhone cover now. So. Um, I'll do the trimming and show you how it worked out. So. Okay, so I've just removed the part from um, from the mold. It's very very light, so I'm quite surprised with the results. So I've got a scale right here, and just to show you, so 
so the part weighs just six grams so it's, it's very very light and the camera and it's quite strong as well but it needs some improvements maybe I can try to do some um, some further stuff with this okay so here you have it uh, it's an iPhone the cover is on top of it so there's a small I could just add some more reinforcements on the inside just to make it fit perfectly for 100% and so on but this is a cool prototype so I'm very happy about this and I'll try to develop new techniques just to improve this and make some cooler more awesome covers with it so that's for this tutorial Everything went as expected, so I'm left with just a shell out of fire glass. Um, it was quite easy to do, went quite fast also. Um, maybe next time I'll just put some gloves on because... Um, to